Hey everyone, welcome to the latest edition of Nets Post Game Plus. Chris Sheeran and Frank Isola with you. The final score of Saturday's game at Barclays Center. Nets 128, Heat 124. Nets get Kevin Durant back in the lineup. That helped. That was huge. But Kyrie Irving's fourth quarter was what stole the show. Yeah, 18 points for Kyrie in that fourth quarter. They needed every single one of them. Miami scored 13 straight points at the start of the fourth to get back in it. Here's the thing. We've talked so much about Kevin Durant, Kyrie Irving, James Harden. Mark it down. Tonight was win number one for that group. I think Sean Marks, Steve Nash, and these players believe there's a lot more wins ahead of them. One of a heck of a lot more. Brooklyn's big three combined for 71 points. Durant led the team with 31. Their work helped the Nets withstand a career-high 41 points from Miami big man Bam Adebayo. Kyrie scored to 18 in the fourth, but Joe Harris was smoking early with six three-pointers in the first half. Following the game, our Michael Grady spoke to Joe and asked him how big the victory was for Brooklyn coming off a pair of losses in Cleveland. It's huge. Um, you know, obviously a couple of tough games, but able to find our rhythm here early. And then at the end of the day, a win is a win, and we'll take it however we can get it. With Kevin sitting last night, this is just the second game where we've seen Kevin, Kyrie, James with the rest of the group. I know folks want things to be perfect right away, but what is this process like building continuity, connectivity out there, and trust? Um, you know, it's tough. Uh, like you mentioned, you know, this is the second time where we've had this entire group together. Um, it's going to take time. You know, we just got to be patient. Um, no need to panic here early. Um, you know, it's one of these things where we don't have the luxury of having a lot of practice time, um, a lot of time together where, you know, we're just kind of throwing it into the fire. And uh, you really got to be patient with this whole thing. It was big four tonight. You had seven three-pointers in this game, matching a career high, 20 points in the first half. What were you seeing out there that allowed you to be so aggressive and set the tone for the team? Um, you know, I think just playing off of those guys. Uh, you know, they make simple plays where they're, you know, facilitating, getting in the middle. And, you know, I'm just kind of trying to find space and get room and rhythm shots. Brooklyn and Miami will have a rematch Monday night. Coverage begins on Yes at 7 o'clock with the pregame show presented by FanDuel Sportsbook. For Frank Isola, I'm Chris Sheeran. Thanks for watching. That's Post Game Plus.